The farm to fork strategy sits at the heart of Europe's Green Deal. It outlines the ambition to transform European food systems into the global standard for sustainability. It acts on challenges such as climate change, biodiversity loss, and the degradation of land and sea. It does that while ensuring that the economic, social, and environmental fundamentals to generate food security for future generations are not compromised. It puts emphasis on enabling a just transition for all actors and all citizens. For all those reasons, it's logical that the Green Deal call on the horizon 2020 also includes a farm to fork topic. A topic that calls for demonstrative projects. Demonstrative projects to address four challenges that are pressing, urgent, and key in the context of the farm to fork strategy. The first challenge is the challenge to achieve climate neutral farms and or achieve climate neutral food businesses. The cha second challenge is the challenge to reduce uh, the use of pesticides, antimicrobials, fertilizers and harmful nutrients towards zero pollution. The third challenge is the challenge to reduce food loss and waste. And the fourth challenge is the challenge to shift our diets towards more sustainability and health, diets that are sourced both from land and sea sources. These demonstrated projects will be asked to maximize synergies and minimize trade-offs between the three dimensions of sustainability, social, environmental, and economic. And they will also be asked to pay attention to the fact that their solutions uh, respect planetary boundaries. Each of the projects should integrate the following elements. They should apply a system approach at the basis of their plan to tackle a specific one of those four challenges. They should use a multi-actor approach whereby they engage partners to co-create, test, and demonstrate solutions. They should use the most appropriate mix of innovations in the context of the challenge that they are addressing, not only technological, but also looking at social aspects and other aspects that would help the transition towards sustainability. They should also, of course, because they are demonstrated projects, spend enough uh, time and uh, actions on uh, communication and engagement, not only in the regions where the activities take place, but also beyond. <laughs>